is the entrance. This is not an entrance. That's blocked off. Definitely don't want to go that way. There we go. De Anza Springs Resort. It looks very resorty. It has, we have resorted to this. No longer clothing optional. Oh, it used to be clothing optional. You must put on clothes. All right, so we're at a former nudist resort. Keep going, almost there. Oh, and they're having a, um, like a wellness retreat here this weekend. They wanted me to participate in some wellness activities. I'm like, I, I'm well already. Hiker parking lot. I don't need to go there. I need to go to the office. It looks like people live here. It's wild. I mean, some of these are permanent. I feel like I'm at a, a luxury slab city. And these are the temporary ones. But some of the other ones look like they were permanent. Do you hear that? That is my air conditioner running. I am plugged in. I never never pay for plug-ins on campgrounds this is nice especially when it's 100 degrees out is this to your satisfaction this air conditioning roxy be a lady close your legs come on come on this is not the clothing optional place anymore you got to put some clothes on I think I would get heat stroke if I was out there doing that. 97 degrees. And these kids are having a dance off. <laughs> Health and wellness retreat. Good for them. Like my son tried to get me to do hot yoga. Like, I don't know what it's called. Bikram or something like that. I was like, uh, unless you're prepared to take me to the ER, there's no way I'm getting a hot box and doing yoga. <laughs> oh my goodness. We are parked over there. And this is the park here. We have a pool tennis courts, which aren't functional. Come on, baby. What is that? that actually stay here I think year round. I mean there's structures so okay which way do I go? I think I go right. Train no exit. I am not good with directions that's for sure. Roxy's like can you please roll up the window and put on the air? Okay Roxy. Beautiful sight though, you know, to have that backdrop. Office. This is the way I came in. Okay, put your clothes back on. We're going into civilization. You can check out anytime you like, but you can never leave. Welcome to the Hotel California. Look at the little quail. Cute little family. Go ahead, little family. Like, wait for me. Beep, beep. No, he's not a roadrunner, he's a quail. <laughs> I was wondering, I look. Ooh, what was that? 
That was a coyote, wasn't it? He's looking for the road runner. Ooh, lock your kids, lock your wives, lock your dogs. Where'd you go, little Wiley? He went through there. or keep her in the stroller. That video that I posted a long time ago in Quartzsite about my place not feeling safe anymore, I learned a lot. I learned to keep Roxy close by on a leash because the coyotes would just snatch her up. And I learned snakes can still be out even when it's cold, they could be hiding under rocks. And somebody wants to pass me. It's like 10 degrees lower when you're under shade. Railroad tracks. I did not hear the train last night, that's for sure. No trains. I heard people up celebrating till three o'clock in the morning. I mean, it didn't keep me up. I was fine. It's only 99 degrees. Lizards are passing too. Gotta let them go. <laughs> Everybody, everyone wants to cross when I'm leaving. What's next? lizards, the big lizards are out, that means the snakes are out. That's for sure. The clouds are helping keeping the sun from beating down too hard on us. Roxy's already exhausted. She's... <laughs> this heat just takes it out of me. I'm not gonna be your backseat driver today. You let Jesus take the wheel. All right, Roxy, we'll handle it. Always living on a prayer and 